Welcome to Mr. Yu's Unthinkable, where we explore the ideas and craft of building thinking classrooms. Today, I'd like to talk about the setup or the whiteboard. As you can see, the whiteboard space is separated into three sections. The top part is called banner, and the bottom part is a working space for students. I use these whiteboard tapes to separate the sections. And, uh, I use these uh, broom holders to keep the markers. I often say tips down. This uh, will keep the marker last much longer. A magnetic eraser. Each group has this huge playing card. Indicates when they get a card, they can go to their symbol. So if they get an ace, they can go to ace. If they get two, they go to two. Now, I will talk more about the banner in the future, but the working space, I'd like to discuss a little bit. What I acquired over time is I split this working space into two by putting a tape. This made a huge improvement for the group work for both students and myself, because when they work on solutions, they write down the solution on this side, and the next question, they write down the solution on this side. Having left this solution from the previous question, um, sometimes it guides them, sometimes it gives them a hint. It gives a trace of their thinking process still behind. And then when they finish this side, they go to this side by raising the previous questions, but they still have the previous question solution on this side. Each time it gives some trace of what they did before, which helped them quite uh, a lot. And also, for me as a teacher, before they didn't have this tape, the solution was all over the place and I wasn't sure exactly what they're working on or exactly which question they're working on. This just simple line in the middle helped me identify which question they were working on uh, much better, much faster. And students were also finding that because the solution wasn't kind of hidden all over the place, and they weren't just erasing random space because they needed more space. Um, it was uh, organizing uh, their uh, trace of thinking with these sections. So that's the tip that I'd like to share today uh, with the line in the middle and the setup of the whiteboard. Thank you for listening and see you next week.